Hello everybody, All Night Gamer Guy here. I'm back to playing more Yu-Gi-Oh! Doing the Duelist Challenge. We're going up against Sledgehammer. And I've been working on my Monarch deck and my Dragon deck lately. So I think I'm going to be choosing... I'm going to use my Monarch deck. I added a few cards and been practicing with them lately. Let's see. Nice. Oh, he's got gem knights. I better save this. I summon this under the world squad. No, I don't want to activate this spell card. And now I get this acro I get to tribute him in order to summon the zero. <clears throat> Excuse me, the Thunder Monarch. Thanks to his special ability, he can destroy one monster on the field. Boom. Then I'll place two cards face down. Oh crap, I didn't attack. Oh well. What the heck? Okay, that's odd. Okay, I see. Let's see here. Activate this card only... You have no... O cards in your extra deck. And control a tribute monster. Oh heck yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I got no extra cards in this deck. Don't need them. Okay. Interesting. What did he send to the graveyard? Ooh, dang. A Sphinx card. That might be trouble. I'll attack again. Once per turn during your opponent's battle phase, is reveal one trivial. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'll activate it. I'll end my turn. Crap, I can't activate my Book of Moon. Wish I could. Nice. I activate Pot of Greed. Even nicer. Now I activate Monarch Storm on front. Now I get to sacrifice his gem knight. Now I can summon Crystal the Shadow Monarch. 
Now I can destroy one card on my art on the field. Very nice. Now Shadow Monarch will attack directly. Shadow Monarch will attack. I need to get another Monarch monster on the field. Otherwise, I ain't getting nowhere just by destroying his face downs. Let's see here. If you have no cards in the extra deck, target one face up a tribute summoned monster you control if yeah, okay. Huh. I'll save that for later. Hi, buddy. My cat just came to visit me. Hi. Alright, I'll activate another pot of greed. Hello. I'll activate Pantheon Theum of the Monarchs. Now I send this one to my graveyard. Now I get to draw two cards. And look at that. I get to draw another two cards. Thanks to Pot of Greed. Now I reveal Tron's Monarch. I reveal my Rock Monarch. Now from my deck to hand... I'll take this one. March of the Monarchs. Then I'll activate it. March of the Monarchs. Then I'll activate Return of the Monarchs. Now I activate the first Monarch trap card. I place it in defense mode. Now, I sacrifice it to summon Grandmar, uh, the Rock Monarch. Now my Rock Monarch will destroy. And thanks to my spell card, I get to take a Monarch card and add it to my hand. And I choose the Underworld Monarch. Now, attack my Monarchs. I activate my trap card. Now I'll normal summon then my underworld monarch. And all I have to do is tribute one monster to do it. Now I activate my March of the Monarchs ability along with my underworld monarchs ability. I send one card to the graveyard. Actually, I'll send... Hmm. I don't think I need another Monarch card, so I'll send this one too. And I'll destroy that face down.
I'll get M Mobius Mega Monarch. Now, my Underworld Monarch will end this duel. Sledgehammer is defeated. Now, next time I'll go up against Hugo. And of course, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. All Night Gamer Guy, out.